Good afternoon. My name is Tracy Wilson, and I'm excited to interview with you today for the position of Assistant to the Dean at Wake Technical Community College. My experience of over 15 years in the administrative roles and my education, as well as my drive to do well, will serve me well in this position. I'm well versed in all aspects of Microsoft Office and have over 20 years of consistent experience using it on a daily basis. I take pride in my work and am effective at ensuring all aspects of my work are completely finished and done at or above goal level. I'm efficient, hardworking, self-motivated, and a great team player according to previous and current employers and co-workers. In my current position, I have a voluntary storm role. We go all hands on deck if we have a storm role during storms, whether it be an ice storm, hurricane, tornadoes, any major power outages. During these storms, I'm tasked with receiving, processing, and completing all requests for storm vehicles to be rented so that our strike teams can go and strike. They need vehicles to go and assess the damage. They need vehicles to take material. They need vehicles to take people. They need vehicles to take the food back and forth to the teams that are working and not getting breaks. We also have to deploy our teams of in-house mechanics to ensure that our equipment that we're utilizing is functioning at or above minimum requirements. All deployments are fast paced and decisions are made within minutes versus having months or weeks to fulfill a request. During the largest storm of 2020, I was the only one of our four teammates who was actually available and on task to handle the rental. So instead of just handling it for my region, I handled it for all of the Carolinas. This was one of the biggest storms we had in 2020. I put in probably about 35 hours of overtime in a weekend. And I was able to meet the high demand for these rentals in an intense and quick fashion without anything being missed. The request came from multiple states, multiple people, and it was very stressful because I was the only one tasked to, to handle, whereas normally there are at least four of us. But I feel I was able to successfully handle this task despite the amount of pressure that we were under to make sure everyone had what they needed. I have dealt with our eight customers probably not the age level of most of the students that we'd interact with in this role, but as a dispatcher for propane, we delivered propane to homes for heating. I rate customers happen all the time. Many customers would not take responsibility for why they ran out. It was always our fault. And I had to calm down our customers and mitigate the situations often. It's never a good thing for someone to run out of propane and not have a heat source for their home. And it always caused people to be upset. And despite the fact that they wanted to blame us as their provider and their carrier, oftentimes it was their responsibility because they were not a customer that we checked because they didn't want to be. So we had to be creative and make sure that we weren't saying, oh, it's your fault, not ours. And I was able to implement some policies that allowed us to service them more quickly when they did run out without charging them a whole bunch of extra fees and things like that. And by implementing these programs, it helped the stress of the situation. So I feel that I was able to make sure the customers were taken care of, make them understand in a professional manner that, you know, we can't consistently go out there just because you run out when you're in charge of maintaining this, this information and to make sure that the situation was resolved in a manner where they weren't without heat in the dead of winter. I've done a lot of research on Wake Tech as it is in my home area. And I guess the only question I have at this time is how many assistants to the Dean are there? Are there differences in their roles or are we all doing the same tasks on a daily basis? Thank you very much for taking the time to meet with me and complete this interview with me. I will follow up with you in the next couple of days to see where we stand and to see if you need any additional information. Thank you.